Hi, welcome to this next video from 3ds from 3ds Max to Unreal Engine 4. We are skinning the brawler from the video game prototype. This is the next part. This is the video number nine. So I hope you are learning. Let's continue. Vamos a continuar en poniéndole aquí los huesos al al mesh. Un proceso que se llama skin. En el video anterior puse la piel este, transparente. Voy a ir aquí a realístico y lo voy a cambiar para shaded. Para que no se vean las sombras. Estamos. Entonces ahora vamos a continuar. Más o menos ya tenemos esta pierna. ¿Ven? So let's undo this. And let's continue. So let's select this. Let's edit envelopes. And let's on the other 3ds Max software they used to show this by color. But now they don't show me the colors. So I I I really don't know how to activate that because that is super helpful you know Autodex está uniendo 3D Max y la porquería de Maya y me quitan cositas chulas que tiene 3D Max para que sea compatible con Maya entonces I don't know where to turn on the color stuff but if you know color always Ahí, vamos. Píntalo, píntalo. Color all weights. Pues, ponme los colores que ya los seleccioné. Let's change to this. Let's select this vertex right here. Let's have it number nine. Because this 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 bone is this bone up here. And here number nine too, alright? Both bones need to control this junction right here. Ambos huesos tienen que controlar esta unión aquí para que no se explote. ¿Está bien? Para que no se explote. Vamos. Entonces le dije que me enseñara los colores y no me los quiere enseñar. Aquí abajo, ¿ves? Ah, míralo ahí. Apaguen este que está aquí. Apaguen este. Show color faces. Turn off this one so you can see the colors. Ok. Now it's, it's easier for us to do this thing. Alright. So now we have the shoulder. This one's blue. It can be blue. Blue means zero control okay so let's select all this
Ahora sí. Fifty. And then with all those vertices selected, select the uh, elbow and have fifty two. All right. Entonces ahora este hueso controla 50 y este hueso controla 50. Vamos a probarlo. This bone is 50% and this bone is 50%. Let's test this. Oops, it breaks again. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to have on the uh, on the uh, y axis this this number copy copy okay so now i'm going to move this and what i'm going to do is that this bone doesn't need to have control of this junction here, okay? So what I'm gonna do is undo and I'm gonna select this skin again and, I'm, and I will select the uh, shoulder bone and I will go to the uh, edit edit envelopes up here and I'm gonna give this one, all right? One. All right. And I will select the the elbow, and I will have this as one. All right. So now let's check it out. Let's move this forward, and now we are good to go. You see, because this this break is up here. Esta esta para arriba. Pues entonces este hueso controla estos vértices y este hueso controla el cuestión que está acá atrás. Está bien, la, la puya esa que está allá atrás. Estamos. Y así poco a poco seguimos bregando con los controles. Vamos, mira. ¿Vieron qué chévere? Vieron cómo se queda ahí bien. It looks nice and neat. Right? Remember to turn on the colors. Let me undo this. Let me save. Let me select this. Remember to turn on the colors by turning off face and turning on vertices. Alright? So now. Let's select this. Let's edit envelopes. Edit envelopes right here. Okay. So let's select all these. And for now. Oh shit. And for now, 
all this for, for now because we have other bones all right but for now we're gonna select all this and all this for now and I will have this as right here number one okay make sure again to show all colorways and turn off this all right so now let's no 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 let's cancel this and let's move this forward you see how the chest now stay in place So let's end this video, vamos a terminar este video, continuamos en el otro video. Este con el skinning process, this will take a long. So bye.